Coach Glass joining us, and, and first of all, Coach, first day is always kind of an exciting one with the, the, the action always being on the buck and shoots and a little bit for the breakaway on the other side. Walk us through a little bit of your just emotions bringing in three kids into this round. Yeah, no, excited to watch our students compete, you know, um, be at this level and be competing at the national level or at the national finals is great. Um, you know, it's an exciting event. The atmosphere is different than a lot of the rodeos we go to year round. And, you know, they, they had a little bit of tough luck today, but I think they'll bounce back and do well in the next two rounds. We'll walk it through kind of step by step on each rider. Dixon Tatry in the opening round, he started off his actual group uh, out, out there on the Bulls. What was kind of going through your mind and what, what, what did you see in his ride? You know, I, t I try to tell them, them guys the same thing every time, you know, bear down and give a winning effort. And, you know, he was trying, we'll kind of give him a little change up there and uh, just miss setting his hips. And uh, that was kind of the end of it at, at this level. It's just one mistake and it'll cost you. Over for Peyton on the other side. Looked really calm when she was getting in here. Did you did you talk to her at all going into it? Do you, how 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 were her nerves kind of getting set up for this round? Yeah, I mean, I visited with her, and you know, she was she seemed focused and like she always is, and just things didn't go her way. Talking over on the other side for Griffin, same kind of thing as Dixon. Got a, got a little bit of a rough start out of the gate, but it seems like the confidence for all three of them is still pretty much up there, and and Griffin's no less than that. Yeah, absolutely, and especially in the bull riding. I mean, anything can happen at this rodeo. We've seen them, you know, win this rodeo on less than four heads. So they're still in the mix. They just got to show up the next two days and, and try their butts off and give themselves an opportunity to win. Talking about moving forward and kind of the mentality and the approach going forward. Bull riding, you ride one, you're pretty much going to Saturday. There's, there's a very small chance you might not, but how helpful is that for a bull rider when you can have that reset mentality of each bull's the, a new chance? Yeah, it's the same thing as like baseball hitters talk about, just having a short memory and next to bat's the one you got to take advantage of. So I think both of our both of our students are going to step up to the plate and, and get one road. And on the flip side, you and I were talking a bit about this for Peyton. She's one that can really be more aggressive out of the shoot now. It's not trying to put three together. It's just trying to go and, and put your best effort on each round and win a round. It, does that help a little bit when you can try to just be fast out of the shoot and just try and go for that quick time? Yeah, I mean, at this point, she has nothing to lose. So, I mean, she's going to gonna take a start she needs to take and, and get the rope out of her hand. So, um, you know, she's she's uh, one that can – she ropes fast and is, is one that is tough to beat. Coach, thanks for the time. We'll look forward to talking to you more as this event goes on. But get some rest and we'll see you on Monday. Thank you.